What is up guys, Pyrotoad here, and this is kind of like a, a random video, I guess, like, we, it was a last minute uh, decision, uh, but we're going to this expo at uh, one of the smaller ones, it's the, it's like Lone Star Reptile Expo, so um, I'm going to head in there, get a little bit of supplies, um, as I said, it was a last minute decision, so I'll record a little bit, I'm not going to record like a whole lot. So guys, I'll see you when I get in there. Alright guys, we just got inside. Look at all the little leopard tortoises. Look at that cage, that's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. Four hundred dollars. Four hundred. That is beautiful though. Those guys are so adorable, guys. So, yeah, we're trying to make our way through the crowd, guys. So, I'll see you guys in just a minute. All right, guys, we just passed the dart frogs. Oh, my gosh. Look at those guys. What is this? We got salamanders. Red belly salamanders. Okay, let's go over here. Look at this. Monitors. So yeah guys, I'll see you in just a second. Guys, and they have these awesome vivariums. <gasps> Look at these crusties. Creamy. Oh, it's not focusing. So yeah guys, see ya. And just... <gasps> oh, don't open it up. It's a day gecko. So, uh, see you just What is up guys? I am back. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah there we go. So, uh... If some of y'all may know my gecko Apollo, my crested gecko, I got him from this booth a couple months ago at the same expo, and he was the one who helped me, and, can I get your name real quick? Sean. Sean. Alright, and so he has like, great supplies, great geckos, Apollo, as you y'all know, is doing great. He's out of Austin. Yeah, he's out of Austin, here it is right here, here's his card, come on, camera focus. Um, uh, I don't know if I want to focus, guys. It's not going to focus. Oh. It's, it's basically, let me see. Let me, check, let me see the card. Uh, nothing on back. So uh, he's got dishes. Uh, he's got food, etc., etc. So guys, uh, definitely go check out when you come to the NARBC Gecko World Austin right there. Uh, so yeah, guys, see you later. Hey guys, we are back moving. I just got some supplies. And look at those guys. They're so cool. Uh, I'm going to come across here. Roaches, yummy. Yeah, my mom has a fear of roaches, guys, so. So, I got them from uh, Austin. Or, yeah, so. I will see you guys in just a moment. Guys, we've just been moving along. We're almost done, which is so sad. Look at all these snakes, guys. They have so much animals, but. That's a mo is that a mossy leaf tail, I think? Is that a mossy leaf tail? No, yeah. these are mossies right here. Oh, he just looks similar. It is still a leaf tail. It's He's bigger. cute. Look at his eyes. Oh my gosh, that's that so nice. Wow. What is up, guys? Pyrotoad here. And I am at Rose City Reptiles, and they have a Pac-Man frog stand. So, can I get your name? What? Can I get your name? Yeah, it's Joey. Joey? Jesse. Jesse? Colton. Colton. Alright, <laughs> so uh, here's a card. Hopefully it will, it will focus now. Um, let's it's, see, yeah, it may be better here. Focus. There we go. Yeah, there you go. So, that uh, Instagram, Facebook, there's their cell. Basically, they have really nice looking Pac-Man frogs and uh, setups. And You're about to find one. Yeah, I'm about to purchase one, so I I fell in love with this one right here. That one's so cool. It's so but um, I'm gonna purchase one with a starter kit for now, and we'll just move up from there. So there he, there he's right there. And there you go. So yeah, um, thank you guys, and see you guys in just a moment. Guys, Pirate Toad here. I currently just got back from uh, the expo and. I probably will add this into the expo video, but this is like a pickups and a setup video for an animal I got. 
and the animals in that container. I don't know if you can see them. If not, then just I'll get to them. But first, let me get into what I got. So let me uh, open this bag. So I've got that right there, which I'll show you in a second. But I got this uh, bag of deli cups, mini deli cups, small ones, a lot of them. And there's a specific reason why, which I'll show you. Um, let me find it. Okay, here we go. I got some dishes for my crusties. So for Apollo and for uh, Godzilla over there, I've got these le uh, ledge dishes. I'm gonna put them on the side so that they can actually climb up to them and uh, use them because I, you, I, I'd, I'd prefer to have them up high than down low. So I got those. Uh, it doesn't want to focus. Um, they're 15 a piece. So those I got two of those this and um then what else I got one sec oh here's some more cups then over here okay guys so basically I got a uh Pac-Man frog now let me find him he's right here I have not named him yet I will think of a name for him very soon there he is right there he's like an orangish color uh camera doesn't want to focus on too close of objects He's really cool. He's a pretty young. He's a youngster, pretty much. So I have this bin here. It's a starter kit, pretty much. I'm gonna have him in here for a while. I will upgrade him into a bigger size container. But uh, yeah, guys. So I will get right back to y'all when I have got his tank to where I can start setting. All it right, up. guys. I am back. Uh, so yeah, let's go. Here he is, right here. And put him off to the side, and then. So there's already air holes in there just so he can breathe. In case y'all are wondering, it comes with this little uh, plant, a dish, a bag of uh, soil, and I'm probably gonna add some extra eco earth and spray it down. So I'm gonna start off with adding a little bit of the eco earth here. So. Okay, that was a good amount. That's perfect though. Okay, eco earth has been added. So I'm going, I'm going to spread it around, and then I'm going to get my mister. This always comes in handy. Spray it down real quick. You really want these guys to stay quite humid, so spray it down. Make sure their soil is always moist. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some of this stuff, add it with this, and make it mixed around so it. It'll look much better. All right. So put that in there. Now I'm going to spread it around. Make like a multi substrate for him. Lots of good room to uh, hide in and burrow in. Me, um, I'm gonna mix it around while spraying it. So there it is right there. So I'm gonna mix it around while spraying it. All right, so it's nice and wet and it should be all good. All right. Let me get a paper towel over these. Oh, here they are. Handy dandy paper towels, guys. Always, if you're going to be a reptile keeper, always have paper towels. Because they will come into the most use ever. Alright, so. There we go. Now I'm going to put his little uh, plant. Right over here. For him. Provide a little bit of cover for him. Uh, I think I have some moss. Yeah, I have some moss I'll put in there. I want him to have lots of humid. I want it to be very humid for him. And I want it to... I want him to have lots of good hiding places. So I'm going to put some of this moss in there in the corners. Moss, guys, is good. Really good for tropical animals. So put this in there. That should do just right. 
And I'm gonna spray that down now, so. Make sure the moss is like sopping wet. Okay, now moss is nice and soft. And put that up. I love the moss because it gives their tanks like that real jungly smell. Then I'm gonna put his little lid in there, or his dish, I mean. Get this stuff out of the way real quick. Okay, this dish is good. Let me get some distilled water. Um, or I'll put this bottle of water because this, this is spring water, so it's not, it doesn't have like a bunch of chlorine or anything in it. There you go, perfecto. So I'm gonna give y'all a view real quick. There it is. Um, now we're gonna introduce Mr. Whoever his name, no, Mr. No Name, into his container. So hopefully he doesn't try to bite me because Pac-Man frogs can be aggressive, but we'll find out, I guess. Okay. go now put some of his uh put a little bit of his moss in there too come on mister go slowly let him go off into his new habitat all right i'm gonna keep his cup in case i need it for anything there he goes all right let me show you guys uh should be right there. i don't know if you can see him right there So there's his tank set up. Um, yeah, I'm still a little stuffy, guys, by the way. So I'm gonna put this on, and then booyah, he's ready to go. So um, pretty much the, that's my pickup. So I got the two dishes, some uh, cups for the dishes, his tank, and him. And I probably spent about the tank, like, like probably 70 bucks there. And that, that was a pretty good deal. On him, so um, yeah, guys. Uh, hopefully, he'll grow big. He or she, I'm just calling him him for now. I will try to name him very soon. So, that's all for this video, guys. See you later.